Hi there guys, I'm Chris Bowden and welcome to the Geek Group. Today we are battling pseudoscience and helping the environment here at the Leonard Street Labs. As you can see, we've got the entire main demonstration hall filled to absolute capacity with 150 pallets of pseudoscience. We've got these zero smoke things, and uh, what happened was the company totally went out of business. And the reason why was they were selling these for like 20 bucks. Well, inside, you open a package, so you've got your first layer of packaging, and this is in, this is actually the second layer. The first layer of packaging is a clear plastic clamshell. So you, we, we put that in one box, and then you've got this, so we get rid of this. And then you've got a book, and it's like a 32, well, 32 page book, all about how biomagnets are going to help you quit smoking if you put these stupid little magnets on your ear. And inside the book, you have a little pouch Inside the pouch, you have the card. And I think there might actually be, no, it's just one card. And then on the card, you have two magnets. So you have to work your way down through 50 layers of crap and you get two magnets. We take these magnets and they go here on the end of our de-assembly line. Excuse me. And we have a lot of magnets. This, this is our magnet pile. And magnets are fun, and we're saving the real magnets to use those for real science. All the rest is just crap marketing nobody cares about. What's happening though, is all of this would have just ended up in a landfill. Because the guy who made them for the, because see, somewhere there's a scam artist who is hopefully rotting away in a Turkish prison, who came up with the idea of doing this, and he paid a pile of money, and he paid probably a dollar or two a piece to get these made by taking a quarter's worth of magnets and a dollar's worth of marketing and selling them for 20 bucks a piece. Well, eventually, people are gonna find out it's a fraud and it's a total scam, and they're gonna say, okay, we're not gonna buy these anymore. And then the last batch ends up sitting for years in a warehouse, and these are all dated 2008, so they've been sitting in a warehouse for years. The gentleman who owned the warehouse is losing a pile of money on the job, losing a pile of money on having to store all this stuff, so he said, hey, can you help us out? We said, yeah, we got, we got people, we got friends. So we took all of it and we're taking it all apart and we're separating everything out. So instead of this going to a landfill, all of this gets recycled. This is one type of recycling and then we've got corrugated here. Here, I'll dig one out. This is blue corrugated, so it's colored corrugated. And then this one is P-E-T-E, -E, plastic. So that's that's a whole Gaylord of that. And then we've got raw corrugated, and then we're back into print stock. They, they cycle because as it gets full, they shove it down because they're all very light. You can move this. So that's the project. We're taking mountains of trash and turning it into fundraising. So we're helping the environment. We're helping our local sponsor friend who gave us all this stuff and getting his warehouse cleaned up. And at the end of it, we get magnets. We get giant pile of thousands of little magnets. So this is a big project. So follow along, enjoy the show, and if you want, come on down and be part of the fun. We're gonna be doing this for a couple days, so you could be here on the disassembly line getting awesome injuries like that. I have to hold up my whole hand or it's offensive, because we're in America. But for all the English people, hey, look at my injury! Ah, I hurt my finger! And it, it actually does hurt pretty bad, but yeah, this is it's hard work, it's manly work, it's rugged work! Ah! So, that's what's up. So you guys follow along, enjoy the fun, we'll have more as it happens. This video was made possible by a grant from the Future Girl Foundation. This video was made possible by thousands of private donations from members and viewers like you. Please visit thegeekgroup.org for more information on how you can donate and become a part of our dreams of Avalon.